Assalamu alaikum, brothers and sisters. Welcome to year six of the 17 Verses podcast. I'm your host, Maher Haq. In this podcast, we take a small selection from the Quran every day and recite it to you in plain English, so you can get a small slice of God's word while you go about your day. By averaging 17 verses per day, we're able to break the Quran down into manageable pieces and finish it in one year. If you enjoy the podcast, please help spread the word. Tell your friends and family, subscribe in iTunes or Stitcher or wherever you get your podcasts, and write us a review. Show notes and a text episode can be found at 17verses.com. That's the numbers 17-V-E-R-S-E-S dot com. Today's selection is from Surah 72, Al-Jinn, or the Spirits, verses 1 through 15. These verses discuss a beautiful speech of the jinns who embraced Islam after hearing the Quran and how they also have different religions and sects and some who submit to the will of God and others who deviate from the truth. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful. O Prophet, peace be upon him, say, It has been revealed to me that a band of jinns listened to the Quran then returned to their folk and said, We have heard a wonderful Qur'an which guides to the right way. We have believed in it and henceforth shall worship none besides our Lord. Surely our Lord's majesty is exalted. He has taken neither a wife nor a son. Some who are foolish among us have been uttering atrocious lies about God, and we had presumed that no man or jinn could tell a lie concerning God. Indeed, some individuals among mankind used to seek protection with some individuals among the jinns, so they caused such jinns to become arrogant. As a result, they presumed as you presumed that Allah would not appoint anyone as a messenger. We searched the heaven and found it filled with stern guards and shooting stars. Before this, we used to find a seat in heaven for eavesdropping, but now eavesdroppers find shooting stars lying in ambush for them. We did not know whether an evil was intended for the dwellers of the earth, or whether their Lord intended to guide them. There are some among us who are righteous, and some to the contrary. We have sects following different ways. We know that we can neither frustrate God in the earth, nor frustrate Him by flight. As for us, when we listened to the guidance, we believed in it. So he that believes in his Lord shall have neither the fear of loss nor of injustice. Surely there are some among us who are Muslims or submit to the will of God, and some who are deviators from the truth. Those who have adopted Islam have found the way to salvation, and those who have deviated from the truth will become the fuel for hell. Amin. This concludes today's episode of the 17 Verses Podcast. I hope that this selection helps increase your understanding of the Holy Quran just a little bit. If you like the podcast, you can subscribe in iTunes or Stitcher and write us a review. Or you can grab the RSS feed and put it into your own podcast app. The show notes, including the text version of this episode, can be found by going to 17verses.com. That's the numbers 17-V-E-R-S-E-S dot com. Thank you, and be well.